and he's more balanced to the left. She also told me, um, I don't know if this is good or bad, back him up four strides and ask him to canter. And then he, he goes back on his haunches and... Sure. Rain back to canter for eight exercises. No, you'll have to see if you think it's hugely different like I do. No, Margaret had to run him into the canter. And she told me to always hold the outside rein yep. and just play with the inside. Yep. I mean, I think she was really good. She did well by him. Yes. Yeah. I agree. All right. Good girl. That's lovely. Nice and soft. Right. See, to, it's to the left, though. Yeah. That's right. I mean. It's lovely the other way, too. They're all one-sided. But I didn't care because he's totally bomb proof. Well, that's, yeah, and you're not going to get one that's totally even, unless you're paying a lot of money. Well, you can't even find him if you pay a lot of money. Yeah. I mean, this woman was the centralized Fjord breeder. Uh -huh. And she said it's very unusual to find a horse even his age because people keep him. Yeah. And the only reason he got sold is because they knew when they bought him that the girl would go to college in three years. Okay. And they had another fjord. And they didn't want two fjords. Tell me when you're going to canter and then I'm going to tape it. <laughs> 